Alrighty, I'm just going to show you guys how we fill the local cryotherapy machine because it's pretty exciting. First we undo the clamp that holds the hose tightly around the neck of the liquid nitrogen doer. Then we remove the magic wand. So we pull it out and it has a little bit of drips on it still. So you just let it kind of evaporate before you place it gently in its little holder. The next part, I am going to wear my gloves. So I take my liquid nitrogen fill hose, which in my case is uh, permanently attached to one of our micro bulk doers, and I stick it in probably just about as far as I can. And then I'm going to turn the nitrogen on very, very slowly. So as you can see, just the pressure of the liquid nitrogen entering the doer is causing some of it to spill out. So you just want to take turning up the liquid nitrogen pressure very slowly. And sometimes it gets a little exciting. It can be. You just want to make sure that you're far enough away from the doer so if it does rise up um, in a little bit of a eruption volcanic effect <laughs> that you're not um, standing close to it and never under any circumstances should you look into the doer um, just because at any point liquid nitrogen may spew out the top and you just don't want to be in the line of that fire. So we let this go. It takes about five to seven minutes to um, fully fill the liquid nitrogen doer and, um, and then we're good to go. Okay.